Matt Ogle with Vite Media, and I'm speaking with Ty Blevins of Fiscal Baseball. All right, so senior year, y'all just coming off another SBC championship. What's the mindset? How is it? Uh, how is the team preparing for this upcoming year? Well, we have 15 seniors, and all 15 have played in three SBC championships for baseball. Lost one, one, one. So I'd say the expectation for us is just to have fun, enjoy the last year together because we played together for four years and hopefully win it um, and, and at least get there. I mean, it's very possible this team has quite the precedence, quite, or quite the precedent, I should say. Uh, so are you going anywhere for college that you're aware of yet? I'm not. Not yet? Not I mean, yet. still, you might get some offers this year, but I mean, still, as long as you're having fun, that's all that matters. Uh, as the catcher, What's it like kind of having that responsibility? You're essentially the quarterback of the infield. How do you take that? How do you get the team kind of prepared once the game's, once it's coming down to the nitty gritty? Uh, it's good. Our infield actually is very young uh, for a senior heavy team. Uh, most underclassmen are playing outside in the infield and uh, our ace is a junior. And so it's, uh, it's good to keep those guys, you know, calm and cool under pressure situations because they can uh, kind of lose it a little bit. But uh, yeah, so. Try to do. All right. Uh, is there any uh, is there any uh, particular athlete you like to model yourself after you see as a role model? Yeah, I love Tom Brady. I know that's kind of a cliche <laughs> answer, but uh, no, Tom Brady. He wasn't the uh, most like an athletic dude, but he just won and he got it done. So yeah. It seems like yeah, over every single year, if you look like from beginning to end, he just kept getting more slimmer and that's right. more like <laughs> toned. Yeah, I mean, he was like, what, fifth round, sixth round? Sixth round, baby. And he ended up, he's the GOAT. So. The GOAT. Yeah, all right. A uh, little more fun question. Uh, maybe celebrity dream date. Celebrity dream date. I'd say like Anna de Armas or something. Yeah, I'd go Anna de Armas or Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer Aniston. Yeah. All right, yeah, you got a little difference in yeah. age, but yeah, Anna de Armas, she, she is very... Very attractive. Very attractive. Uh, she's out here listening to this. She's yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, she's a baddie. Uh, so, uh, hmm, what's you, what do you think has been the most fun memory you've had at Episcopal? Potent, could be with the football team, could be with this team, maybe a tournament, anything like that that comes to mind? I'd probably for sure say winning football this year is probably the best sporting experience I've had. Winning last year with baseball was fun too. I was just, I guess it didn't feel as, as real because I was a junior. I started a year left and... We haven't played the season yet, but uh, I'd say Kerrville last year with baseball was really fun too. All right. Well, we're looking forward to this upcoming season. I'm sure you are ready to end on a high note with your experience at Episcopal. Well, thank you so much for your time and good luck this year. Thank you, man. All right.